everybody loves it, don't they? We've had yeah. a few a few visitors come and stay, and um, they're just pretty blown away by it. Most people are taken back by the awesome view and and the subtle curved lines. It's just got a, an absolutely amazing feel to the home. I met the clients um, back in 2003. They're from Sydney, and they had a retirement plan to do the design, do the build. Of all the people that we spoke to, he seemed to be the one most in tune, I guess, with what we were after. The client's wish list was for a pavilion-style home, and obviously um, they wanted to take advantage of the views. We gave him our back of the envelope sketch, <laughs> and then we had a lot of telephone discussions, because we were in Sydney, and he really, I guess, developed the brief. Well, the extreme steepness of the site was certainly a challenge. We're situated 320 metres above sea level, so we're in a cold, a cool climate zone. And so my design strategy was really hinged upon the fact that I was able to harness the natural form of the null. And so we've got this curved roof form that actually deflects all the, um, the southwesterly wind. And at the same time, inside the home, we've got this convex ceiling form, which extends from inside and pushes you out through to the greater, um, the greater landscape. We wanted a house that fitted into the land and also wasn't a big drain on natural resources. And, and I guess that fitted obviously with Mike's philosophy as well. Some of the sustainability features are a 30 tube apricus solar hot water system and that's mounted on the subfloor area at 42 degrees which is the ultimate pitch for solar wind again. We've also got a series of, of water tanks for household use, also for the sprinkler system. All our grey water and black water is treated on site and recycled as well as um, having LED light fittings right throughout. It's a really comfortable house to live in. Modern houses often look a bit stark and hard. Um, and I guess it does have a number of hard surfaces, but it doesn't feel that way. It's a comfortable house to live in. We've used a really fine sand texture on the internal walls. They're a blade wall. They're actually 290 mil thick and filled with grout. So they've got that thermal storage ability to store heat. Some of the other materials we've used is CSR Residential Express Wall. That works really well with the L-shaped type glazing on the southern side. We've used some mini oil as well. I wanted to have, obviously have double glazing. But the weight of the double glazing in large stack of sliding doors, um, that was crucial. So to be able to have a high performance product that could handle that weight is very important. The Thermal Heart series certainly is the best on the market. We're moving into retirement. We don't want to spend a lot of our time maintaining the house. So all the materials, they're virtually no or low maintenance, and certainly aluminium you know, fitted that category much more so than timber would have done. Plus it fits with the whole palette of the house. I yeah. mean, the design, the, the finishes, the yeah. colours, it just is very unobtrusive. The clients had no idea how responsive this home would be and basically um, an hour, an hour and a half of sunshine um, with the passive solar design and, and using the right glazing and the right aluminium framing suite, um, they are absolutely over the moon. There are a lot of things I like about the house, but there are two things in particular, and Anne laughs at me about one of them, which is our bedroom. It just feels like you're sleeping in a tent and you look out at the view. And the other place that I really like is the ensuite bathroom because it feels like you're showering outside and you look out and you feel like you're in the trees. To me, it's an awesome home to actually take out the recent HIA CSR Australian Home of the Year. Certainly a testament to the detail and the quality and the choice of materials and um, I'm really happy with that. I like being there. I, I just find it a, a really comfortable place to be. We're just very lucky to have it. We're yeah. really blessed to have it. such a beautiful house.